So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get the orange joggers with the orange duffel bag in GTA 5 online after the new patch of 1.69 and also the click and bell DLC. So it's going to be a very easy method and yeah, you'll be able to get both the orange joggers and the orange duffel bag and you won't be losing any of your current outfits doing this method right here. So it's actually going to be two different methods. So the video will be separated into two different parts. Before we get into the video, quick shout out to one of my newest subscribers here on the channel, Bass LOL. And if you do want to get a shout out just like Bass right here, all you got to do is click that red subscribe button. So be subscribed to my YouTube channel and you might get a shout out in my next video. All I do is I pick a random person from my last video that has subscribed and then give them a shout out in my next video. I also do clothing glitches, car merges, and also do go live with subscribers and do car meets. So if you're interested about any of those things, just click that red subscribe button. And yeah, quick word from our sponsor. I think you're going to have to load into online, go to jobs, and then go to to bookmark and you're gonna have to start up this job right here called power play now i will leave a link in the description down below to bookmark this and you can bookmark this on playstation and also on xbox i'm not sure about pc um, but yeah so if you're on playstation obviously bookmark the playstation one if you're on xbox bookmark the playstation i mean the xbox one and by the way make sure you do restart your app because it's not going to show in your bookmark jobs right away you have to first restart your app and then go back in and you'll see that it will be there uh, now you're gonna have to start it up and just invite anyone it could be just a random anyone literally could join us now once you did get someone to join you you're just gonna have to start it up and by the way if you don't have anyone to actually join you just join our discord down below in the description so now if you want to get the orange joggers going this team and the pink jaw or uh, purple joggers on the other side so obviously you click on the video for the orange joggers and orange helmet so this is the theme i went on now, once you do load in, you will see that you don't actually have the orange joggers and orange helmet yet, but you just sit here for a second and it should appear. So don't back out of the mission right away. What you're going to have to do is open your interaction menu. Uh, you're going to have to go down to accessories and just change the gloves. Or you could just add on glasses if you do want to keep the gloves. And now just back out of the mission. And by the way, if you are enjoying this video, make sure you do subscribe to my channel. If you haven't done so already, I uh, also do go live with subscribers and trade modded cars and also do car meets and drag races and I also do upload car merges and outfit uh, glitches. So if you're interested about any of those things, make sure you do click that right subscribe button. So you're going to need the McTony robbery, uh, which this week is the Piss for Comet S2 Cabrio. So if you are watching this video uh, as of March 15th or like this week, it is still available. So you can start up this one and you will have to do a scope out mission, which takes about like two to three minutes. Uh, you have to scope out a submarine. And now once you've done that, go back to your salvage yard and go back outside and you will see that there is a prep mission on the map. So you're going to have to make your way to one of these. It's going to be uh, the security outfit prep missions for the McTony robbery. Now you will have to find a duffel bag. So what you're going to do, so you should be able to find it, the security outfits. And you're going to have to pick up the orange duffel bag just like this. Now, actually in the footage, I did mess it up. So uh, I did actually mess up the whole glitch. But if you do it correctly, you will be able to actually save the orange duffel bag. So at the end, I will show you which what you don't do, all right? Because, uh, yeah, because I didn't mess it up at the end. But if you don't mess it up, it won't work. So now just make your way back to your salvage yard. And you're going to have to land in the salvage yard just like this. You're going to have to jump out of your helicopter and then land exactly on the yellow circle. So just land on your yellow circle. And you have to jump out. Make sure you call Lesser just in case you get the cops. And then jump out of the helicopter and just land on the yellow circle. So the yellow circle... Make sure, uh, so you don't don't just walk in, you're gonna have to land exactly on that yellow circle. So it's gonna be pretty easy. So depending on where your salvage art is, it could be a bit harder. So just like this. Now make your way to ammunition and what you're gonna have to do is go to parachutes. And now you're gonna have to equip this specific parachute right here, the Israel parachute, uh, this one right here. So I'm pretty sure it only works with this one. So the Israel parachute, just equip this one uh, right over here. And now once you've done that, you can also try this with the regular parachute, but I'm not sure if it does work. Uh, so yeah, just make your way to, now what you're going to have to do, just call out like a flying vehicle. Just any flying vehicle, it doesn't have to be an oppressor, it could literally just be a buzzard from your CEO, which will only cost you 25000 And just make your way to the mask shop, so the mask shop by the beach, uh, that's the only one that's on the map. So just make your way over there, uh, using your helicopter. And by the way, if you do, didn't drop a like on the video so far, make sure you do. Just real quick, we'll drop a like, uh, literally the like button. Just click on it. It's free. And yeah, I highly do appreciate it. It uh, helps me out do more videos like this. And also, let me know in the comments down below if any of these methods did work for you. So other people trying this out also do know that it works. And they can go ahead and read the comments and know that it does work. And if anything does they get patched, just make sure you let us know. Um, but these these been working for a while, so they probably won't get patched. 
So what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to jump out of your helicopter around this height. And also make sure you have brobbed authorities because you might get the cops after the helicopter has fallen. Unless you're using an oppressor. You're gonna have to land with the parachute on the left side. So the blue and pink t-shirt. She's gonna have to land right there. Uh, so left side. So here I actually messed up the glitch, but I'll show you uh, when it does actually work. So I don't want to apologize. I accidentally messed up the glitch. I clicked right on the D-pad a bit too early. Here I'm going to show you how it should look like when it works. So here I also got the green duffel bag. It works for both, so uh, it was just a different mission. So you're going to have to land a bit further away from them and make sure your character like crashes like this and just spam right on the D-pad. And now you'll be able to save the outfit just like this. And just save it to any slot. Um, in this footage right here was the green duffel bag, but like I said, it also works with the orange. As I did show you, I just had messed it up the glitch at the end. And you can't actually redo a robbery once it's done. Uh, yes, if you did enjoy this video, also make sure you do drop a comment down below. This method did work for you, because I know some people will say it doesn't work. Because I accidentally messed up the glitch. So make sure you do let them know it does work. And drop a like on this video if you did enjoy it. And I'll see you in my next one. Peace.